Hey guys, this is JB3, and we are back with another episode of FIFA 21 Career Mode Youth Edition here with Sar Broken. And we will get into the end of July here. It's against Bayern Munich 2, who were the worst team in the league last year. They bounced all the way up into the top six, so it should be a good test to see where we are and see if this team is ready to compete for promotion. We'll also move into the new month. We have our scouts coming back, so hopefully they'll have maybe one or two players that we can really look out for that can really improve our team as we look to get better here and look to get into Bundesliga 2. Let's get started here against Bayern Munich. So we will get into this one. No change to our lineup. Team that looked good, even though we had the 4-3. It should have been 4-2, but thanks to an own goal, they were able to get one. Offense looks dangerous. Let's see if Parra can find another and get us three points. And we'll get this one underway. Probably get the ball in here. Right in the middle. Can we get back? We dig. Good cover. Petit can't get there. And another early goal will go in. It's Byron Munich, too, who will launch one right through our defense and find an early goal. It's 1-0, only three minutes in. Oh, ball's right in the middle. Dangerous here. Big shot from Cook. We'll make the grab. Oh, driving in here. Can we break it up? Guillaume there, right in front. Cook knocks away. Petit gets it cleared. And luckily, it falls all the way to Cabin. Cabin, a long ball out. We'll find DeLonge. DeLonge moving forward. Cuts back in here to Parra. Parra through to Sullivan. Sullivan kicks the long coon. Has a chance and he'll blast it in the back of the net and gives us a 1-1 one -one game here. Good passing there. It's a great play from Sullivan to nicely hold up the ball. Drops it off to him. And then it's Coon one on one with the keeper and he will find another goal there as we just move it right across the field. And into the back of the net. The dig gets the ball here. Coon drops it off Sullivan. Sullivan driving forward, holds up, gains possession nicely. Through to Parra. Parra now holding it through, drops it off. It's a good chance, and Cabin finds it off the peel of Parra as the controller battery dies. Corner here will go to Byron Munich. They'll send it in. The dig there on the cover off the post will go. Coon picks it up. Gets it off to Guillaume, and he will carry it out nicely defended there for Sarver. Sullivan moves it along. Cabin kicks it back to launch. Launch with one man to beat. Kicks it in the middle, looking for Parra, who finds the back of the net. In three to one, as Sarver can continue to roll here against Bayern Munich 2 and pick apart the defense. They'll find another goal. It's three to one. It's going to be a drive straight in the dig over once. It's Renault who's back. Cuts him off. It's a long, long ball. Can they keep it? And they do. Somehow right in front, and they'll find one back. Final minutes of the half, and they break through with the goal. Uh, we were just a little out of position. Couldn't get there. Byron Munich, get back in it. Three to two. One last chance. DeLonge gets on it. Can he find someone in the box? No one there yet. Has a chance, crosses it up, looking for Parra, couldn't get there. Cabin tries to send it across, it's a poor one, and that will send us to half time. Where is it? Corner here, lined up, it'll go right in. It's a good one, and Cook makes a great save off a powerful header, sent it back in, but then clears it off the line. And it's controlled along the box, still in pressure though. Can we break it up? It's a good cross, it'll be sent in, side netting. Bruno has the ball here, has options, but move it to Sullivan. Sullivan quickly up to Parra, Parra now, but men coming forward, does he have what it takes? DeLonge back to Parra, Parra slips it on Sullivan, edge of the box, goes back, DeLonge back into Cabin, takes a strike and it gets just knocked away. Kern gets it in, the dig, trying to break up, over once, it's a dangerous one in the middle, can we get to a man to it? No! No, just a little miscommunication between the center backs. And three to three here in the 59th minute, Byron going to come roaring back. Parra goes off to Cabin, has a good chance there for Sullivan, right through the middle, surrounded by the defense. Tries to get it to Kuhn, and they'll just barely break it off. In the middle, dangerous territory here. They've done well. It's another long shot. Cook this time knocks it away. 
Oh, into the middle again. Dangerous here. Petit doesn't come out, doesn't have a chance, and that shot's going to go in. Because Petit just not aggressive enough at the back. Really needed to close down his man, didn't do it. Gave him too much space in the box. And they find what could be a winner. Four to three. It's centered back to the middle of the field. Has a chance here. Can we break through? Good pass. Ahmed takes a heavy touch. Can he beat the kicker? He does. He has his first goal here in the 83rd minute. Ahmed finds his first goal of the season and first goal of his career here with Saarbrook. Comes on late in the game and gets a good, nice little play there. Right through from Bourgeois. And he puts it into the back of the net. Gets us level again. 4-4. Four four. Delange gets it out wide. Cabin. Can we find a winner? Cabin. Driving home. Has it through. Delange makes a touch. He'll send it up. Has Ahmed in the headers in the back of the net. He has two and a game winner. 5-4. to four. Ahmed puts it home here for Zarbrook. And in the final minutes, within 10 minutes, Ahmed has two goals, including a winner. A beautiful cross there. Gets his head on it and puts it in the back of the net. Driving forward here, final minutes as we're deep into extra time. Takes a reflection. The launch picks it up. And that should blow the whistle, and it does. It's not much defense here. Sarbrook can take a 5-4 to four victory. Ahmed getting the brace. So we are here our first month in Ghana, and haven't brought back anyone yet, so we'll hold for another month. So we are here our first month in the Ukraine, and we have Arsene Serko, who will come in as 6'4 goalkeeper, which will be good height. Pratula will come in as well, 52 to 70 overall, 77 to 94, looks like he will be a decent player. And we are here our first month in Switzerland and haven't brought back anyone yet, so we'll hold for another month. And so we have our youth academy coming along well. Elbus here is the best of the bunch. Kobol still looks good though at a right wing overall. We have Pratula, we just brought in 77 and 94, 58 overall, so he could be pretty good here. We're going to get rid of Rutu. His potential is just not there. We got so many other defensive players that we can bring in just to get rid of him. Jan Bauer, Brower, 56 overall, looks pretty good. And we have just bring in from Ukraine, Serko, the goalkeeper, 54 overall, 68 to 94. We'll see where that goes. So we've done a little bit of business in the two weeks that we have had off. Bourgeois will go out on a one year loan. He's asking for a lot of playing time, and I really like. Lloyd Reese a, a bit better than him in that central defensive midfielder role. So it will be a low offer with an option to buy. We sold Jean Cousin, who will leave for Sligo Rovers. Sligo Rovers, who cares? And of course, Cork City always come in for the absolute dumpster fire players. And Gavin Phillips will be joining them. And we'll get into the game here against Swakow. It will be no changes to the lineup. Offense is doing well. If we can maybe keep the ball out of the net, we should be able to pick up some more wins. Let's see if we can get another three points. And we'll get this one. Under one. The launch goes to Kabin nicely. Swings it along. Sullivan. Sullivan looking for Para. Para gets to him. Boom. Right in front. Right off the goalkeeper. Beautiful shot there. And he gets a hand to it. Flicks it over the ball. Kabin to Guillaume. Has a ball there, Paro, Paro, to the launch, sneaks it past the keeper, never saw it coming, and sticks it right underneath his legs, puts it in for a goal, and it's going to be one to nil. Sarbrook to get this game started. Finally, we're the ones to get out to an early goal after letting up a lot of early goals this season. Paro just kicks it along to him, the fender can't get there, goalkeeper can't react, and it's a powerful shot in the back of the net. Balls there, right in front. Sullivan cuts off. Can he find it here? Putting pressure on. Feel a long shot. Kill gets right in front of that one. Oh, ball right through. It's Kabin. Kabin past the defender. Takes the shot in that hand. Flicks it out for a corner. Corner here. Poon will send it in. It's a good chance, and it's heading to the back of that. He has one. 
We knew we were going to get one eventually, and it's a corner into the back of the net as we run right through the car and celebrate with the fans here. Sarbrook and out to a 2-0 lead. Guillaume, the center back, gets his first goal of his career. Oh, they get over the top here. It's a drive. Guillaume can't get there, and they'll find a goal. They knew it was only a matter of time. Defense gets caught out because we were not able to get back. Things were count. Get one back. It's a game again. Two to one. Well, they get around Petit. It's a good chance. Into the middle. And Cook couldn't get there. And it's all even here. 33 minutes. The same thing happens again. We just cannot keep the ball out of the back of the net yet. I don't know what it is. But it's two to two. As we cow break through. Van Houten running here, looking for Parra, gets it to him, has it held up, nicely done, to launch right through the middle here, gets around one side tackle, one in the beat, can he do it, has a chance, in the box, he'll find that it's a nice job there, and nicely wait until the defender was out of his way, Cougars on, and it's one on one with the keeper, and the launch has another goal, and what a nice player this player has turned into B, cannot wait to see where that potential goes, He's 65 overall now. Cuts back inside and blasts it near post. Into the back of the net, 3 2. Oh, into the middle here. Dangerous. Can we break it up? It's a big chance. It's a big tackle. Cook gets a hand to it. And luckily keeps that one out. Goes for a corner. Paul oh, Petit tries to get that one cleared and it's sent right in terms of Cal. Come back with the goal in the final minutes. And that's how one and a half a terrible job. Petit should have just put it up. Thought we could get it to Baker, it's intercepted, and the man with the ball spot finds the back of the net. Oh, ball goes in, the arm right in front, Cook closes down near post, sends it for a corner kick. Hora, he's like two Sullivan, looking for Kuhn, he can't get him, gets in front of his man, has a chance, moves it along, Sullivan right there and gets us in front again. And again, the offense will keep us alive in this one. Kuhn, a great job, fends off the man, and then as the goalkeeper races out, lays it off to Sullivan, who finds the back of the net, and makes it 4-3. to three. Parra fights off his man. He'll find Sullivan again. Sullivan again. Sullivan again. Drops it back. It's a wide open net. And Kabin puts it home. And Sullivan drops it to him. 5-3. to Sarbrook and finding the net again. And we might score a million goals this year. A million. Here we come. Sarbrook and right up the gut. Sullivan drops it off before the keeper gets there, and it finds Kabin right in the middle of the box, and all he has to do is tap that one home. Barra right, taps it along Sullivan right up the guts, and we are tearing them apart 6-3. to three. Sullivan just laying it on here in the 60th minute as Sullivan puts home another, and that'll be two on the day, 6-3. to three. Okay, home goes to clear. He couldn't do it driving in. Petite. Oh, no, Petit absolutely levels him, and it's going to be a penalty. What can Zwickau do? Can Cook keep this one out? He has not been three, and he keeps that one away. And luckily, we'll survive. It'll go for a corner. Corner here, right in the middle of the box. Right off the cook. Petit heads it out, and gets it clear here. Still in danger, though. Top of the box. Long shot. That will not keep it out. And off the penalty. They'll find a corner for the net. It's six to four. Alberno gets beat on the inside as he overruns his man. He almost overruns his man. Petit can't get there. Cook gets a hand to it. Still in danger. And luckily, trickles away for a corner. Drives along the end line. Baker there. Can't break it up. It's a chance. T can't get in the way. And Cook makes the save. The four sends it up hard. Parra tries to slip it through, hands gone here, gone through, oh, with a chance, oh no, it's the perfect corner of the post, and that will bring us the extra time, six to four, with one last push for Zwickau, down two, and that may do it, Hunger got here with a chance to bury one, he misses it as he puts it into the 90, and that will do it, should be full time here almost, and if he blocks that one away, could we just blow the whistle, just blow the whistle, almost there, into the middle, a big shot, Renault knocks it away, the boar boots it out, 
and we'll take a 6 to 4 victory. So that will do it for us here in this one as we see ourselves with two victories all the way to fourth position with a goal differential of zero because we do not know how to play defense but boy do we sure as heck know how to play some offense we will put the ball in the back of the net a lot this year it's going to be a matter of whether we can keep it out i don't know if we need cook to be a little bit taller maybe we go back to kelly maybe we rotate him maybe petite comes out we'll have to see what happens who we get back from the youth academy as well so we got some players there to look at but that will do it for us here in this one. If you did enjoy it, make sure to hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications so you can always find out when the newest ones are coming out. And until next time, have a good one.